Okay, I've got a new active campaign account. I've just I've got a trial on, and I'm connecting it to Thrive Themes or thr uh, a Thrive Lead Box, and um, I'm doing it by using an API. So I just want to show you how to do it. Um, so if you go in Active Campaign, if you go into My Settings, there's a box above your account information that's an API and it gives you your URL and your API key um, then if you you need to be here uh, on this this API connection uh, tab sorry and um, you have a drop down box now I've already, I've already actually made this connection but I didn't before I made the video so within this list here um, these are all the things that you can use an API to join Thrive Themes to and Active Campaign was in that list before I connected it so you can, it's actually if you go over to Active Connections it's, it, you can see that I've already connected it but it's as, it's as simple as, as, as putting those two keys in a box and, and adding it just copy and pasting them into the box and uh, it's there are lot that you put them into these two boxes and you make the connection it's as simple as simple as that then if you um, come over to um, the form itself see if we can find the form I think I can find the form yeah here's a f oh. here's a form uh, and then if you all you're doing is actually on the box within your form. It takes you. You can you, you connect it by going on here, yeah, just, and just, just sticking what you want. You, you if if you want the name as well. This one's set up so you, you get the email. If you tick this box, you you'll have the name as well, and the phone number as well. If you tick that box, I just like to leave the email in most cases. So just leave it as it is and. It stays with just the email address there, but it's all connected up and goes straight to um, straight to a list in Active Campaign. Okay, so you can see how simple that is. So I've just switched browsers just so that I can show you the finished article of the of the form that I've created in Thrive Themes on a on a web page. This is one of my uh, websites, and I just dropped it in the bot on the bottom of a page just above the footer. So, I hope that helps. Thanks.